Hello, Gear Bear here, and welcome back to another episode of the Gear Bear Adventures Mod Pack Modded Survival, episode 10. Jeez, we are moving. So, in the last episode, we built the, uh, well, the nuclear reactor. So, in this episode, I think we are going to do just that. We are going to work out nuclear power. So, I don't remember where I put any of it, but let's look. I'm sure it's in here somewhere. That, that's right. Here it is. So, we needed that. Let's see. What else do we need? We needed, uh, of course, our fuel rods, our thermal monitor. I needed some redstone and a redstone torch and useless blocks. Right. Okay. So, perfect. So, let's get right into building our power generator. Now, before we do that, I just realized... We should build ourselves the, um, what's it called? The MFE first. So the MFE takes these energy crystals. And the energy crystals needs the energium dust, which needs, okay. So that needs diamond and redstone. I have the redstone, so let's grab half a stack of diamonds. Oh boy, that drained us. So let's take these energy crystals. And how many do we need? We need... 9 times 4, so that's 36. So let's just set that recipe. And, oh, I need to make this into diamond dust. So let's put that in our macerator. We should put our overclockers in there. I do apologize about the lag that we may experience. Um, and stuff like that. So let's see, where did I put those overclockers? Um, generator's full power, which is good. Um, so let's put those there, because this thing is really slow. Um, but we are going to get ourselves some nuclear power. I'm so happy about that. Let's see if that guy's still here. Okay, he's not. That is perfect. And uh, what is this blue thing on the mini-map? What, what is that? It, oh, it's the waypoint. I see. That's our waypoint from Zan's mini-map. So, what was this? I, I feel like I'm looking for something, but I'm not. So, um, yeah, let, let's get our nuclear reactor going. First, we want the MFE. I remember saying that I was going to go to the other dimension, but because that guy is gone, I'm not going to do that today. Um, so let's see. Six, that's enough to build the first one. So we needed... What was it? We needed 34 of them, of course. Um, so we needed four of these and five redstone dust. So let's put those in there. And we've made our first Energium Dust. So let's put those in the... Not that. Put those in there. And let's wait for it to make some more diamond for us. Okay. We'll wait for it to make two more dust. And then we will go... And let's see. Okay, so that'll make our second one. So it only needs four now. Let's put these nine diamonds in there, and let's, let's see, it was one, two, one, two, one, two. So let's put, yeah, we are going to get our nuclear power going today. I'm happy about that. And we're going to make what's called an LZH condenser, which makes, I'm um, okay, so we've got one of those. An LZH condenser is one of the coolant cells that is available. Come on, go. Thank you. Okay, we can make our remaining ones. Let's put our overclockers in there, and apparently it only makes one at a time. So let's put those in there. Let's put one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five pieces of redstone. Get our energium dust. Let's grab that other one, and let's put those in there, and we shall wait. So I am excited. So what else do we need? We needed gold cable, which needs two rubber and one gold cable. So I should have gold. Gold cables can be made in the this thing, right? Okay, so how many do we need? We only need we only need four. So I think that means I only need to put two in there. Let's get out our overclockers. Well, actually that needs Well, I guess we should go to sleep then. But I am excited. We're finally gonna have nuclear power. Power is not gonna be an issue. We're gonna have our MFE. I think maybe part of the problem is the insulate, the lack of insulation in our cables. Okay. Nope, never mind. Ah, oh, why, why did I have to waste that? Okay, um, well, I'm experiencing some lag. So I do apologize. I'm going to have to use my memory clean again. 
and geez, I hope we unfreeze. Okay, we have. Perfect. So let's grab ourselves some copper, put the remaining gold in there. Not copper, what's it called? <laughs> Rubber. So we need two per one. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, so let's just grab tons of it. So let's grab that, and we'll put our copper cables there. One insulated. Um, there's another insulated, and let's make it so that... We can make three more insulated gold cables, and let's put that rubber back in there. So now we have four, and we have an extra gold. So let's put these four in the four corner. What do we have to put in the middle? Oh, basic machine casing. So let's grab ourselves, what is it, eight iron? Yeah, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And let's build our machine casing. Let's grab our from there first. And let's make plates you know what i thought i had a forge hammer in here so let's use the rest of the forge hammer unless i used all of it you know what i don't know where it is right now so let's put those in there Got our eight iron in there and yeah so i mean uh we need to move the quarry again too so please don't do that okay so we need to move the quarry again, because that thing is... Stop, 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 no, stop. Ah, oh, stop, please. Oh, I, I really don't like spider webs. They are just horrid. They, ugh, they're annoying. So we'll leave the chest there, we'll get rid of the quarry, and no, I want to grab my engine there. Okay, so we'll grab that, and I think we'll just make it right next to it. So let's grab our other electric engine. I want to get our quarry going so we can get some more uranium going. Um, so let's see. What is a good spot to put the quarry? Um, I think it needs to go right. Oh, that's perfect. So um, I don't think there's anything of uranium sources down there. So let's just help this thing out by clearing out this little space here because that is going to make it start out much quicker. So we needed to run our power over here. I should have some extra cables. I needed to put... Okay. So I need to put uh, an extra lever down there. So let's see. I, need, I have four electrical engines. I need to put one there and I'll put the... How come I only have two levers? I should have three. I must have dropped one. Oh, well, actually, I think I know what it is now. Um, well, actually, I only need to have it like that, right? And then I should be able to take my copper cables from over here, take them. OK. And I'll need to, uh, OK. Um. Well, no, actually, oh, yeah, I'll, I'll be using an extra block anyway. I'm sorry about that, guys. Okay, so let's keep going. I need a few more copper cables, which I should have in the house um, somewhere. So, because those electrical engines... Okay, I only have one. I thought I had more in... Hmm. Mm hmm. I only have HV cables, but that's probably a waste. You know what? That'll do us for now. It's just the problem is you lose power when you don't insulate your cables, and I definitely use plenty of lose plenty of power. But uh, you know, hopefully that won't be an issue for us. So let's grab out the high voltage cables because I, I need to save the well. Actually, the high voltage use more than gold, I think. So let's get our gold going. Oh no, no, not there. Um. Jeez, I, I'm sorry. Things are a little bit slow starting out today, so let's go there. And then I need one of the high voltage cables. Should oh wait a minute, I don't have a chest. That's right. I should go grab a chest before that thing starts splurging box blocks everywhere. This is gonna be annoying. Okay, so let's see. We need two. Duh. Let's see. Do I have a chest in here? 
I really, yes, I do. Okay, let's grab those two, and let's sprint over there, because it's going to start, uh, it's going to start splurting stuff out, and I don't, oh my god, see, there, there it goes already. Okay, it's putting them in there, we got our quarry going, hopefully power won't be much of an issue right now. It's not letting me sprint, that's weird. Um, okay, well that, that must be why, jeez, I mean, okay. Let's go in here, and, uh, tsh, what did I need? I needed the Energium Crystals and, uh, that item casing. So, right, let, let's get on to making our MFE again. So, let's go there, and I need to put one there. And we've got that, so let's put it in the middle. Let's put four, um energy crystals around the outside and what else do we need we needed our four insulated gold cables to get our lovely mfe so the power uh so I, I wish i could just let this drain we're actually gonna have to lose all that power i'm going to you know what right now it just doesn't matter to me um so let's put our MFE down there. No. Okay, fine. I'll get out my wrench. I'll get out my wrench. Um, where did I put it, though? Uh-huh. There. There we go. There's my lovely wrench. So let's shift-click this thing down here. Okay, I didn't... I don't... Uh, I don't remember how to use a wrench, guys. I think I remember now, though. Okay, shift-click. Okay, perfect. So let's connect that extra piece there come on okay so let's wait for that to fill up it's still going up so that's nice um this thing is still pretty cool this geothermal generator you know okay so now that we have that we can finally hook up our nuclear reactor so let's get rid of this because this is going to get in our way and it's annoying so just so everything doesn't blow up i'm going to make a case around it so um we're, we're gonna allow it to have plenty of space i think we need five by five so i wish i had a diamond shovel really okay well i have plenty of diamonds in there so let's go make ourselves a diamond shovel i need a stick that's always something you need isn't it okay let's grab we need two sticks sorry Okay, two sticks, and let's grab a diamond, a diamond. Like so, I think we have emerald tools in this game, too. So, but compared to, like, good stuff, diamond is actually really sucky compared to some of the great, like, I mean, gosh, ore spawn has some OP tools. Like, it has Big Bertha. Man, that thing has, like, 750 attack damage. It's absurd. Uh, no, that's the Royal Guardian. Um, it has 500 attack damage. Like, I find that absolutely nuts. So that's one, two, three, four. There's five. So that's one, two, three. Okay. So four. Okay. So just in case this thing blows up, which it should not, because I'm going to have a thermal monitor... Okay, so what we need to do is place... That's the middle, right? Okay. We need to place our nuclear reactor in the center there. And then get rid of that. Let's get our six reactor chambers. Let's place them all around this. Um, I need to place it on the bottom. There we go. Okay. Let's place one on top. And let's place one right there. So, the way I'm going to do this is I'm going to have a thermal monitor and, let's see, where's that redstone torch I had? Bef there it is. Okay. Right there in my inventory. So, this thermal monitor is going to shut it automatically off when it reaches, I'm going to set it so that it, when it reaches a temperature of 1000. So, it's going to be right there and what's going to happen is... Huh? Oh, that lever. Well, let's put that somewhere else, shall we? Right there. So, 
what's going to happen is, is it's automatically going to shut the reactor off when it gets too hot. But I'm going to have it like this, so that there's going to be a redstone torch right <coughs> excuse me um so what's going to happen is there's going to be a redstone torch right there and it's going to shut the rest let's say um we have minus 10,000 and as you can see it turns the redstone torch off but if we turn it back up to 1000 like that the torch is on so right now we're going to have it off because we have to load our reactor um, considering that we only have five fuel rods, I'm going to make one quad fuel rod, which takes... I don't even know what... I think you need... Let's find out, shall we? Um, we need... Let's see, my CPU is at 17.8%. We're doing fine, okay. So we need uranium fuel cell. It is this one, the quad fuel cell. So I need three iron and two copper plates. So let's grab ourselves... Selves two copper. I also need to make some more cables. So I'll grab a few more pieces than that. We'll make it so that there's nine cables. So we'll make, first of all, I only need two plates. So let's put that in there like so. And I think I need, I need iron. So let's grab, we need one, two, three, three iron plates. So we're, we're moving along today. We're, we're going to get our nuclear reactor going. I absolutely promise you. We are only 16 minutes in out of our 35 that we'd like to have. So this is going pretty well. Perfect. I'd like to have more overclockers. But let's get into making those LZH condensators too. I don't remember exactly how to make those. That's the LZH condensator. So we need... Come on. You're not going to tell me how to... This thing. That, that's what I know on a... Okay, let's see. Um, I want to know... Okay, well, I'm going to... Uh, um, why is it not working with me right now? LZH condensator. That's just telling me how to recharge it. That's the problem. Not shapeless. I want shaped. Well, that's just telling me how to recharge it. So I'm actually going to look it up on the wiki, and let's see right here. Um, oh, I do apologize. My battery's going down. I have to plug my thing in. Just a second. So um, let's keep... Going. Let's let's see what the wiki says here. I'm sorry. I'm just checking the wiki. Um, okay. Um, apparently, Chrome just crashed on me. So let's see. Um, I see to wiki. Let's see. I, I should know the crafting recipe for this because I have played I see to so much. So let's see. L Z H. Condensator. There we go. LZH condensator needs redstone, okay, reactor heat vent on top, which takes copper plates around a heat vent. So let's make a few of these heat vent. Let's, let's see. Um, how many heat vents do we need, period? Let's see. We need RSH. Does that need a heat vent? Now that needs a heat exchanger. I'm sorry guys, I'm I'm a little bit okay, so we need one heat vent there, one heat vent there, and one heat vent there. So we need three heat vents. Let's see if it knows the heat vent crafting recipe. Oh, oh my gosh, my lag. So let's see if it'll let us heat vent. Let's see. Okay, heat vent. Okay, so it's just these crafting recipes. So, okay. We're gonna need electric motors, which I believe needed coils, which we made extra of. How nice. We have 10 extra coils, which is cool. The problem is we need, I think it is iron item casing? Um, it needs tin item casing. So, okay, we have tin right here. So let's grab that tin and let's make it into some tin casing. Oh boy, that lag though. It is bad. So I apologize, I'm going to clean that out right there. So let's make some tin plates. Okay, so while that's going, let's make our uranium 
fuel cell. We'll have one left over, so let's put that there. And we needed two copper. And there we go, we have our quad fuel rod. And we're working on making our um, LZH condensator. I wish it had an EMC value. Then we could just make them in there. Um, let's wait for that. Okay. So let's make these all into plates. Let's keep going. I think... Oh, wait a minute. EMC. Oh. <laughs> so we are... How many minutes in? Let's see. OBS. We are... 20 minutes in. We're, we're doing pretty well, I think. So that that's for... Um, so we need... I think we need... Let's see. This will make us five. I think. If we have... Okay. I don't want that to be made into... Okay. So this will make us five. Let's put... I think I needed iron. Or I, I don't remember exactly how to craft them. I think what you do is you put iron in the middle... You take half and half, and then take half. Okay, perfect. We made our motors. So to make the heat vent, we need four iron plates. That means we, if we're going to make five, because, right, I made five motors. So four times five is 20. We need 20 iron bars, right? No, we need 16. Let's grab 16 iron bars. Let's keep going. I, I do apologize about the slowness. Let's see, we needed iron plates? Iron, iron plates. Okay, so we needed 20. One, two, three, four, five. While those are in there, what else do we need to make? We needed heat vents. Okay, so L, L, Z, H. Okay, come on, L, Z, H. I really wish this would give me the recipe, but it's not going to do that for me. So I'm going to have to go back and check the wiki again. So let's see, the RSH condensators. I hope it gives me the recipes for those. RSH. RSH dash. There we go. Please give me the recipe. It's not going to give me the recipe for this either. So I'm going to have to look the recipe for those RSH, but we need a core heat exchanger which needs a heat exchanger with copper plates around it. So we need, okay, so the heat exchanger, heat exchanger. Okay, so that thing needs an electronic circuit, five copper, three tin plates. So we need one of, no we don't. Um, okay, let's do the math. If I need one of these, I need five, I need five of them. Five of them means I need five times three, 15, 15 tin plates. If this thing would hurry up, so let's see, that would make one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. And we'll get these iron plates. We'll start working on, I don't remember what, what I needed these for. Oh, right, okay, so I need that, half those, half those. Let's put our motors in the middle. I can get, uh, uh, uh. And we'll make that many heat vents. Okay, so we need the rest of our plates. Okay, those are done. So we need 14 tin. We're moving along. We're, we're doing pretty well. So let's get one, two, three, four. We needed, how many more did we need? Oh, I think I need some more iron bars. That's what I did wrong. So I need four more iron bars. One, two, three, four. And I needed one more motor, which I think I should have. So we needed four plates there. Okay, I did make the extra motor. So I need four more iron bars. Perfect. So we've got our four heat vents. And after the heat vents... The heat vents to make the RSH condensators. We needed redstone. Oh, we need more of these heat exchangers. We must, I think we need, let's see. If we're going to make a reactor heat vent, that means a heat vent. And the reactor heat vent only needs that. Okay, that makes sense. So we only need to make these core heat exchangers. Uh, we need three heat exchangers. That's what we need. 
We need three heat exchangers, those, that means we need three electronic circuits, which probably means I need more, let's see, six times three is 18. So let's make some more copper cables. Of course, I knew I'd need more. And... Ah, uh, jeez, this is a little bit... I thought I... I, I cut a... Man, I, I just really thought I had some more copper cables in there. But apparently not, so let's grab ourselves that stack of rubber. And let's keep making more... How many did we need? So I, I needed... Um, what is this thing? What... Jeez. So if that, I, I need 11 more, so that means I need 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Then those two can re. Okay. So, jeez. I, I do apologize. I'm all over the place. So let's make these all into copper cables that have that. And we need. Uh, so we need three circuits. That means we need three iron plates. Um. No, make three iron plates, one, two, three. We'll wait for those to go, and we are, how many minutes in? We are 26 minutes in, so we're doing okay. I really want to get our reactor going today, though, which is the problem. That makes me upset. Okay, perfect. So, we needed that, we need one, two, three, put that there. We have these. Oh, no, wait, we needed... Three on each. So let's take half. Three across the top. Three across the bottom. And we will make our electronic circuits to make the heat exchanger. We need three, so that means we need three of them. So nine tin plates, which I should have. Um, uh, meh. Okay, well th this is... That's what we're going to make for right now. So we needed to put... Jeez, I, I just looked at the recipe. So I need, I need five per one. That means I need five times three, 15 copper. That means I need five of those. Oh, well actually I only need, if I make, so I need two more. Two more of those. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm sure none of you are completely confused with what I'm saying. But like, because we need to make that many more copper plate, or copper cables, so that'll make that makes 14, yeah, I, I did my math right. So what else do we need to put in here? We need to make some more tin plates. So let's get some more. Let's get just a stack of tin and we'll put that in there for now. And no, no, not, not tin cables, no. Okay, well those are useless right now, but okay. Anyways, we needed our tin plates, which I probably should have grabbed while I was there. Um, if we need three of the ten plates per one, that means I only need 15, which I should already have. And I don't know what else I need ten plates for. So let's put uh, three, one, okay, or five, one there. Okay. So then we needed, oh, we needed copper plates. Gosh, why did I... Mm. We needed copper plates. That's what it was. So we need five per one. That means we need 15. So five copper. So let's put those in there. Let's grab our extra plate. Jeez, we are going to make our... I, I, I'm just uh, fingers crossed, guys, that we make our reactor working in this episode. We are so close. All we need is the LZH condensators. We can boot the thing up, connect it to our power grid... And we will have nuclear power. We are so close. We are going to do it this episode. We, we just have to. We have to do it this episode. Okay, so we have our plate. Wow. I, I just made five. Okay, wow. So I need ten more copper. Wow. I, I like how I just thought they just finished. Okay. So let's make one of them. Let's make... Let's see. I needed one, two, one, two... No. Three, four... Okay, so, and then this will only make one. Um, what else do we need? What else do we need? What else do we need? Oh, right, these. Um, wait, we're only making three of them. 
So, oh wait, no, that's right. I did my math right. So we've got five more. Let's make one more. Let's put one, two, three, four, five. Let's put one, two, three. And let's put that on top, and we made one more heat exchanger. And let's grab one more set of five. We're getting there. You know, we, we gotta make a few more LZH condensators, but we are getting there. So, I'm happy about that. Um, come on, pick you up. I guess my inventory's full. Let's get rid of string. Don't need that right now because I have it in there. Let's put five. One there, one there. And perfect. We make three more, and we have the perfect amount of these. My inventory's quite full, so let's empty some things. I don't need food. I don't need you. So let's put uh, you in there, you in there, you in there. I don't need that right now. I don't need you. I don't need you. Okay, perfect. So let's keep going with this. What else do we need after we had those? So we needed our RSH condensators. We need a core, ex core heat exchanger, which needs copper plates. Of course, it needs copper plates. Let's, it needs seven copper plates. I think it, I think we should just put a stack in there because I, I think I'll need more than that. So let's put those in there. I wish I had more overclockers. Let's see how to make an overclocker. So we need three 10k coolant. You know what? I'm not, I'm not gonna think about that right now. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that, guys. I'm choking on my own. <coughs> I do apologize. So let's keep going. We are 31 minutes in, but this might be one of our longer videos. Um, or we need seven, eight, one more. Come on, keep going. We need one more. I, I'm really hoping we can do it in this episode, guys. Um, so let's put one of our heat exchangers in there, and that makes the core heat exchanger. Perfect. So now we need to make our um, RSH condensators. So, sorry I keep flashing back. This is the wiki here. So I need redstone. Okay. So redstone, that's all I need. Um, I need redstone around there. Perfect. We can make two of them because that's what I need. I'll put one. That's supposed to make... I don't get it. That's supposed to make an RSH condensator. Yeah, heat exchanger, heat vent, redstone. I don't get it. Why isn't this, uh, this is a heat exchanger. That's a heat vent. Uh, you know what? RSH dash. Yeah. Well, considering that this is not cooperating with us, I am going to throw away 14 redstone because the recipe is not working. And two of those. So let's go into creative mode. And I'm going to throw away one of those, one of those, and then another one of those, and that one. Throw away the 14 redstone. And then I'm going to cheat myself to RSH condensators because I deserved those. So let's go back into game mode S. And what else do we need? I'm looking at the R, the um, LZH condensator recipe. I need one reactor heat vent, which needs... Okay, heat vent with copper around it. So I know the recipe now. So I'm going to stop going on the wiki. And um, now oh, we need some more redstone, so let's grab that. Um, grab some more redstone. We also need some more copper plates, which are in here. Let's get those out. Perfect, so we have plenty of copper going. So let's put that there. And it perfectly had the perfect amount, except we only needed to make one. And if I'm correct, we should have everything now. Um, I think I made too many heat vents, but that's okay. I'll take them. Um, I need four redstone. Then what do I need? I needed something in the middle. What did I, geez. I just looked at the recipe. And now I'm done with it. No, I'm not. Come on. Okay. Um, we are experiencing a little lag right now. But uh, I'm going to fix that. Everything's going to work out fine if memory clean wants to work. So I see two. 
I do apologize, this video is a little bit slow. IC2 wiki. We are gonna make our nuclear reactor, though. I am so excited to... We already have it. Jeez. Dumb. Dummy. So we have it. But we are gonna make our LZH condensators. We're gonna get nuclear power today. We are going to do that. So LZH... LZH condensator. Come on, load. So we need the core... Oh, we need a lapis block. That's what it is. So, um... I'm going to quit there. And let's go. We need a lapis block. I really wish I didn't have to... Um, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So, let's make one of those. A lapis block. Lovely lapis block. And I wish I could pick up all that stuff, but I can't pick it up. Okay, so I need these two on the sides. I need the reactor heat vent on top. I need this guy on the bottom. I need four reds to please. Four redstone on the sides, on the corners like that. That is the recipe for an LZH condensator, but right now it's not cooperating with me. So what we're going to do is the same thing. I'm going to cheat one in because it is not cooperating with me. That must be why it doesn't have a recipe for it. So we are going to cheat one in because that is the recipe that the wiki says. So um, I do apologize if you guys don't like this, but I have all my materials. So I consider this fair because I crafted them. So we are going to give ourselves the LZH condensator. Or, sorry, um, yeah, a LZH condensator. Why just one? Um, I think I had enough for two. I'm gonna give ourselves two. Two LZH condensators. And that is where we are going to be. So... Let's go back to our nuclear reactor in the back there, and I'm sorry about the lag. I'll fix that right now for us. If this wants to uh, force quit, let's see. Memory clean. There we go. So let's fix that memory. I do apologize about. Oh, you're you're kidding me, right? You're you're kidding me. I oh, that 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 big thing drove me. Oh, okay. What is this? A pincher beetle? What is that? A stink bug. Okay, well, I'm just going to leave him alone. Um, so, let's get our power output from there. I have tons of rubber, so that's not the issue. So, let's make these all into um, these. It should not be too high voltage. Um, so, what I'm going to do is do that. And, okay, let, let's arrange this in here, shall we? Um, uh, I had that. So that should hopefully work. Um, let's get our power going to this. Um, we don't need this geothermal generator anymore. So, when we get rid of him, we can put the power into the back. Where did I put my wrench? I, of course, I got rid of my wrench again. Just seems like something I would do, doesn't it? Okay, there. We'll grab you. Okay, perfect. So, we'll get rid of the geothermal generator. We can save him for later. And we will get rid of these pipes here. We won't have to worry about this stuff anymore. Um, that is perfect. We can go get rid of... Okay. I'm going to keep all this lava here, but I'm going to run copper cables directly... Okay, come on. Mine up for me. So I'm going to run copper cables all the way to our nuclear reactor. Not there, thank you very much, because that is going to cause a high voltage issue and stuff is going to fail pretty much so um you're, you're kidding me I, I need some sort of useless block wool is going to be my useless block right now and we don't need you anymore so let's place this we're gonna get this in this episode I'm happy about that again we're doing successful again so let's make our output you know what forget this 
I'm not going to waste all this if I can just put it out right here. Um, so we're going to put it out right there. And there we go. So let's test out our nuclear reactor. Okay. So our core temperature, perfect. 65 EU per T, which is the is a bigger amount than the other one. So our quarry should be going successfully, hopefully. Um, whoa, that's one of those star things. Let's go get it. No, it landed on my house, didn't it? Wow, because it blows up. Yes, let's get another star piece. It gives us experience. Yep, see, there it goes. And what is this over here? Well, these are campers. This is a tent. Oh, that's right. I forgot. No, no, please don't crash. Okay, so we are 40 minutes in. I'm going to do another little thing there. We are going to get... Uh, we're, we're going. So I am very happy about this. I'm going to do... So, um... This will automatically shut off at 1,000 degrees. But I think I'm going to tone it down to... 800. So this is perfect. We have a nuclear reaction going, guys. So if I can get out of there... Let's see if we have more uranium in here. Um, I don't think we had any more in there. We don't. I just realized I'm still wearing my hazmat suit. So apparently this stopped... Um, oh, well, not both of these engines are going. That's right. So, um, let's put the lever there. I can't believe it. All that time we were waiting. <gasps> uranium! Uranium! Oh my gosh, guys. It has some more uranium there. So in the next episode, I guess we're going to make our nuclear reactor a little bit more powerful with that uranium, right? You know what? I'm just going to do it now. Okay, it's only one piece. So let's teleport back to our home. I'm so this is going to be a longer video. It might even be 50 minutes long. I don't know. But we are going to make this into... He's just walking around my house. Thanks. You know, who welcomed you? Just saying. Who welcomed you? Nobody. Okay. So let's put our thermal centrifuge back down. And this thing... Okay, never mind. Let's change that. Let's put down a copper cable that I had to place right there. And this is perf- Oh, you're kidding me. You're kidding me. I used the wrench. No. Again, this is one of those things that isn't fair. So I'm going to cheat it in. The thermal centrifuge will be cheated in because that just wasn't fair right there. You guys saw it. I saw it. So I'm not going to listen to that. So let's put in our thermal centrifuge. Because we should be able to keep this guy on for now. And let's macerate our ore, because that's what we do with this. And let's get our overclockers, because I don't want to wait the whole episode, a whole episode's length for this. Let's get that, and it's done. Crushed uranium ore, so let's put it through the ore washing machine. And, uh, goes right, uh, there. Oh, this thing is still slow with overclockers. And, geez, I'm sorry, we're 43 minutes in. I know, we're being a little slow, but look at this. Power constantly going up. Okay, still, it's struggling a little bit because we have so many things on. But, um, okay, tiny pile of uranium dust, crop, purified crushed uranium ore. Oh, right, and I need to put this inside of you. And then once we have our second one, which we do, we are going to put our overclockers in here. Oh, you're kidding me. It's heating up. So let's put a lever down because that helps it keep its heat. And we just placed it down. I completely forgot about that. So, <sighs> geez, we're, we're almost there, guys, though. Oh, my gosh. We're going to, let's see, the lever is on. No, it's, it's on now. Okay. State is on. Um, this thing is so slow. Okay. I guess it's moving pretty quickly. We have our overclockers in here. I'm actually going to try and make some more overclockers because we have some extra... Where are they? Um, we have some extra... There's the forge hammer. 
Um, we had... We had extra coolant cells. I, I just... I spotted them somewhere. They were in one of these. There they are. There they are. So we need to put four... So we can make two extra... Which means that we need one more tin plate. And we had a forge hammer wherever it was. I just saw it literally just a moment ago. You're kidding me. You, you guys just saw it with me. Okay, there it is. So let's grab one more piece of tin. And make this into another overclocker. Shall we? Oh, we need... Nope, I need two more pieces of tin. I figured because I only need one more, that's what it was. But okay, so let, let's make one more piece of tin. Let's, uh, whatever that means. Cool. I got some sort of... I don't know. Experience. Yippee. Um, let's put that guy in there. We can make one more overclocker, which takes one more advanced circuit and two extra... You're kidding me. I need an iron plate. Is that really what I need? So, um, the thermal centrifuge should almost be done. Okay, it's still heating up. Okay, that thing is quite slow. So, we needed one, no, two, yes. Yes? Okay, so let's put that in there. We put, actually, we can make, we're only going to make, I'm going to make one advanced circuit. No, two advanced circuits. I need... It's always redstone, isn't it? It is, guys. It's always redstone. So let's make an advanced circuit. Let's get six pieces there, six pieces there. I have three extra. Let's put two redstone on the outsides. Let's put up my plate in the middle, and I'll put that there. And I need two there. See, I remembered the recipe for overclockers. So let's put you there, you there, and you there. And we have two more overclockers. So let's put these in this baby because it is faster than we thought. So let's make two more of the... Let's see, I had more uranium in here. So let's split it up. So let's make this into one more. And one more enriched uranium. So let's make this into a fuel cell, which I need... Uh, I think I need to extrude an iron plate, is what it is. So let's extrude this iron plate with two overclockers. You can keep doing it. Come on, keep going. Really, it just made HV cables? You know what, guys? Considering it takes the same material... Again, I'm sorry. I'm going to cheat in a fuel cell. So, okay, a cell... Come on. It, it's like a uranium. <sighs> okay, we'll go to IC2 and we'll find it, shall we? So it's uranium. The, uh, fuel rod, sorry. Okay. So let's go. Um, I, do, I, I do apologize for the length of this episode, but I am just so excited. So let's put it into our canning machine. Let's put enriched uranium and let's put fuel rod and let's put uh, overclockers probably be done by the time we get there okay um an extra fuel rod so let's go throw this into our nuclear reactor um core temperature is still low perfect so we just got five extra eu per tick from that so we have nuclear power guys how about that so the stink bug's back guys he's back i think he's enjoying himself here in the jerbear adventures home so guys I hope you did enjoy this episode, and if you did, please comment, like, and subscribe to join the Jerry Den, and I will see you all later. Bye!